It was meant to mark the end of an era. In 2017, the entire world said goodbye to the spacecraft that had lived Cassini for a long time in Saturn's shadow. With unparalleled class, it had painted the image of a gas giant that existed before, remained nothing more than a hazy mystery to those on Earth. We honored its achievements and celebrated its mute worship, and finally observed it descend into the atmosphere of Saturn in a ferocious farewell. However, what if we were wrong to think it was the end? What if Cassini saw, in those last moments, something that is so unusual that the data had to be buried and hidden beneath the pretext of telemetry that isn't necessary? And what if that buried truth has only recently emerged not through the efforts of scientists, but through the cold analytic faculties of a brand new AI created to see what people miss? The ultimate image that Cassini took before it died was more than just a snapshot in science. It was an alert one that is encoded in layers of data that seems to be random and alert that we were never meant to come across. However, now that we have, we might not be able to turn away. During the mission's final weeks, the command to dive in between the planet and one of its innermost rings never previously explored by a spacecraft. The move was risky, daring, and historic. Each traversal of the gap sent slicing its way through a torrent of dust and debris moving at a breakneck pace, keeping track of anomalies in gravity and sampling the magnetic environment in its entirety while sending a stream that never stops of information to Earth. As the objective, NASA engineers prepared as the mission neared its conclusion, a final descent is the final plunge that would plunge Cassini into the atmosphere of Saturn, where friction and it would eventually be destroyed by pressure. In the spacecraft during those final hours followed an exact procedure capturing high-resolution images of the cloud on Saturn tops and bands that create a mood. Among these images were discarded without being analyzed, a shot from a wide angle of the South Planet Pole that was taken just before contact was omitted. There was nothing at the time peculiar about it. However, 27 pixels, yes, only 27 of them had a configuration that didn't match the pattern in the air encircling them. They appeared to the naked eye as were of no use. However, a more advanced pattern recognition AI, they were years later, everything. Now we're in the present day, in a quiet lab away from the public eye. A new system for quantum artificial intelligence known as Aegis was receiving deep training, space data sets for structural search anomalies and visual data as well as in the mathematical underpinnings relationships that are concealed beneath the pixels. Cassini's archive was fed as a test thousands of images into the system the majority of which were already categorized, investigated, and deemed unremarkable. However, when Aegis examined that one final picture, the final one it flagged that Cassini had taken it before instantly. Not because of its potential C, but because of the image's content implied. The area that is highlighted, initially regarded as an atmospheric swirl, revealed a collection of symmetric distortions that are unlike any other Saturn's stormy weather. These were not compression errors or artifacts. They were organized. Aegis developed a dimensional representation of the distortion using embedded spectral data in the picture. Additionally, the result was not a vortex or storm, but rather a geometric lattice hovering above Saturn's deck of clouds, something that appeared suspiciously deliberate, like a surveillance node, or even worse, a signature disguised among the commotion of a gas giant. Alarms were raised by the AIS reconstruction within the confined group of scientists keeping an eye on the analysis. The framework Aegis's revelation was not limited to symmetrical. It complied with the referred to as A in theoretical physics, a toroidal non-Euclidean array configuration that is frequently linked to advanced energy distribution systems for propulsion. In layman's terms, this thing behaved differently than any other a feature of the atmosphere, and it lacked naturalness. Also, the distortion exhibited a frequency echo that persisted in Cassini's radio stations had been observing as it descends a signal that had been dismissed previously as noise. However, Aegis found a harmonic and artificial fingerprint modulation, implying that the object was not simply passive. Something was coming out of it. Energy, communication, and surveillance. No one could say with certainty what. 
Then, the team was terrified by the realization that this structure or object had been present throughout the entire orbit of Cassini's Saturn. However, it never caused any alarm perhaps because of how it was made not to. Possibly because it desired to be seen, but only after we were prepared to understand. In the days that followed the finding, researchers began revisiting previous low-frequency recordings and telemetry from the descent of Cassini. They located something frightful. Over the past 19, within a few seconds of sending, Cassini had barely captured a rhythmic pulse distinct from the noise in the background, resonating precisely in time with the magnetosphere of the planet. It was initially dismissed as a byproduct of interactions between plasmas. But following the application of the structure that Aegis had built, the signal perfectly aligned with the dimensions of the alleged in-space construct. To put it another way, the signal and the structure was linked together one might even have been driving the other. Additionally, the pulse contained phase shifts that, when decoded, are embedded produced an eerie fractal waveform similar to those in earlier Voyager versions data close to Jupiter. The repercussions were too extensive to ignore. If the image from Cassini truly revealed a cleverly constructed object that is a part of Saturn's atmosphere and whether or not that object sending signals that echoed Voyager's path, then we might be considering something that isn't just tied to Saturn, something that is watching, following, and possibly responding. As the researchers scrutinized the final one of the data packets from Cassini's descent frame was noticeable not simply because it in the, the clearer or even stranger usual sense, but because it lacked place, a perfectly aligned visual object that cannot be mirrored in frames that are adjacent. The initial, it was deemed an error or failure in the software for compression or an anomaly caused by the radiation from Saturn belts. However, in digital forensics, experts examined the image, independent systems, and, as a result, found the same. The image remained constant throughout all compressions, formats, and format renderings. It seemed as though Cassini had snatched up something that was only a few milliseconds, something that did not deserve to be there hovering just below the cloud deck of Saturn. And when the anomaly was contrasted with the position and angle of Cassini, the geometry was off from the natural horizon. It appeared to be planned, artificial. Even if it wasn't anything, there was briefly, and scientists were prompted to ask a frightening query, did Cassini find something that was hidden from view or something that we were expecting to look? However, the human eye can only see so much. It was only after a group of data analysts fed the raw footage from Cassini into an emerging anomaly detection-focused AI model that the picture started to change. Literally, the AI did more than just improve the contrast or the silence. It recognized structures, patterns, statistically significant symmetries unlikely to emerge naturally cloud platform. The image became sharper and the result sent chills through the room, an unmistakable, faint hexagonal outline that doesn't match any known geological Saturn's meteorological feature. What's more, the shape did not belong to Saturn's famous storm with a hexagonal shape at the pole. It took place in a totally different quadrant, drifting at a layer that should have been devoid of solid matter. The AI identified the shape as being consistent with architecture that is engineered. This is the exact word from the chief scientist later on used in an audio log that was leaked, engineered architecture. If this is the case, Cassini may not just have completed its mission of diving into the atmosphere of Saturn. It might have discovered the need for it to end. The next thing that happened was perhaps the most all-perplexing development, silence. Absolute silence on a strategic level. The data came from public servers. The final anomaly was not mentioned again from official publications. The AI group suddenly working with the footage ceased publishing updates. Some researchers were moved around. Others were asked, according to insiders, to abide by amended NDAs. The few photographs that had been shared on the internet were branded as simulacra or misinterpretation errors. But there were still digital footprints, backups, logs, and insider whispers in the halls of research establishments. Why the abrupt shutdown? If the occurrence was an error, why not provide a thorough explanation and conclude the matter? Yet, they didn't. 
Instead, every move seemed designed to conceal the image even more. And if you pay close attention in every statement that has been made since, there is one phrase that they never used, debunked. A lack of it speaks louder than a denial might be. Cassini was designed to change our comprehension of Saturn and the fact that it exceeded all expectations. However, now, with this obscure image emerging from its digital grave, we are confronted with the possibility that the legacy it left behind has only just started. For a long time, the scientific community has set a boundary between natural wonders and fiction set in the future between imagination and astronomy. But this image, suspended in this frame between data leakage and corruption, forces us to redefine that boundary. What if, after our models of what Cassini saw was real, Saturn is the planet system of presence that is intelligent within our own solar system? It may require more than an update. They might need to be reset completely. The spacecraft whose journey began as an advocate for science might have completed it as a signal for something else significantly older and more prepared than we ever envisioned. The mission of Cassini ended in a blaze of brilliance as it delved into the gas giant it spent more than 10 years studying. What? Then. Now we understand that this was not an effortless descent. It was a funeral a burying of such delicate information, so it had to change the paradigm swallowed up by the planet itself observed. The final image that it sent a flicker of data in the middle of a sea of noise may not be the only picture of Saturn. It could be the first look at something brand new, something that goes unnoticed by everyone along. What if Cassini, a spacecraft that silenced pure science and discovery precisely when it was about to speak loudest? What if that visual was a whisper rather than an accident to whisper either Saturn's or something else's observing Saturn? Now that we are left with a question that keeps coming up, what just happened? Was it organic randomly frozen chaos into a shape? Or was it a handwritten signature of something awaiting our attention to finally mature enough to comprehend it? The sudden silence from the agencies, data, and the AIS findings that were all never officially disgusted suggests a shocking truth that goes against the very limits of what we truly believe about space exploration. If this is what we are, then if that's the case, then Cassini did not just send science back, and it brought back a warning. And now we need to make a decision how we utilize it. So, what's your plan? Consider what Cassini saw in those last seconds. Comment below with your thoughts, because your perspective might just be of use to decipher what the world is not prepared to admit. Make sure to share, like, and if you want to keep learning what lies beneath the stars as a result of the universe is also watching.